Double Dragon. It's your boy Amen. It's like it. Back with some new heat for y'all today. <laughs> You heard what she said. Let's get it, man. Yes, man. Another episode, One Piece. You feel me? Yes, sir. Um, we got like I think I think uh, Luffy met Momonosuke. Yeah. I'm probably saying the name wrong. I don't know. And then uh, he uh, pretty much flew up out of that little trash bin. Then we got Smoker versus Virgo still, which we uh, already spoke about our opinions on that. Yeah. Um. Yeah. And then everybody trying to get the kids from, from not eating the candy and stuff like that. Yeah. It's crazy, Kyle. One Piece is so unpredictable because when Luffy fell down there, like, there's no way in the world, like, you would really think, like, okay, he's going to find Mononosuke down here and Mononosuke going to get some crazy weird power mm -hmm. to fly Luffy back up. Yep. Like, you just don't think about that type of stuff. Like, that's not common. It's crazy. It's so crazy it's, scene of dope. events. Yeah. And um, I think Zoro clashed with Monet a little bit, so. Yeah, or they, or they like about to. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we about to probably see them fight a little bit, but um, yeah, we ain't get to it, man. All right, let's run it up. Yeah. Like she fight with icicle or ice chipper. Hmm. That's yeah. what it's called. I thought she was just chilling. I forgot she got hit in the arm. Jabba, what you looking at, bro? Right, Mocha. Mocha. Oh. There's, there's little mini balls. I thought it was one big candy. She like, you shut up? <laughs> bro, I thought that was baby Sabo for a second. Mm -hmm. They look very similar. Manipulating these little kids, bro. I thought people don't like clowns now. I wouldn't have thought he was a nice person. <laughs> this dude's a master manipulator, bro. Big facts. Man, he got big. All her friends is, is, is freaking physically or well, mentally not there. Yeah. It's crazy how Mocha was able to just kind of break out of it. Yeah. She had the same amount of time. Oh, she. Oh, I was about to ask why she do a flashback of. of uh, she's like, F them kids. Crazy. Finally getting a dose of uh, humanity. Zora even, man, she ain't phased either. What you looking at? Oh, you know what she went, Zoro? I forgot his direction. <laughs> Why you put out Chopper? <laughs> Zoro fast then. He had some type of demon or yeah, the one he was running to. That was wild because she low gear, right? He's like, no, you did not just say that to me. Yeah, don't be talking some back to Dobby. He egg. Ooh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> She's <laughs> Man, stay away. It's impressive of Zora to be able to stop those little mm -hmm. things like with the sword. You gotta be, that perception gotta be crazy. <laughs> Top of bro. Mm. Nice. Chopper going through it right now, bro. 
She could have just bit down, just right in the middle, and just got him. Oh yeah. She like probably going for chopper. Right, he just took an angle. He's like, could have just bit both of them. Hmm. <laughs> she a harpy lady from Yu-Gi-Oh, bro. It's like somebody don't know how to color. <laughs> it sounds close to Luffy's voice actor, low key. Mm. <laughs> really? <laughs> Yes, sir. Hmm. G5. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why are you <laughs> <laughs> It makes a lot of sense. <laughs> <laughs> they bogus. Jake. <laughs> I almost spit on my coffee, bro. This man signed you. <laughs> That's how me here, bro. <laughs> Enjoy, Enjoy this. Enjoy this. Didn't, didn't didn't even comprehend that. Right. You just had to be the one to to to, to be the guinea pig. Hey, I thought he was gonna take all oh, damage to that. I thought his head was gone, bro. I need some hockey arrows or something, boy. Right. So I need to start playing. You <laughs> watch <laughs> Dang, Tashigi. Ooh, she, she got, got hockey. hockey. This works out. I wonder if Zoro didn't want to fight it because she a girl. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of like Sanji, but not as extreme. Let Tashigi take care of it. I like this for her. Yeah. That's some nice seal and chip. Made that up. <laughs> Let your girl handle this, Zoro. Mm. I like this for TD Shigi. <laughs> I feel like she uh getting some pretty good development here. And they yeah. giving her a worthy fight. You know what I'm saying? She be getting finessed. To me, she she get a finesse a lot through that throughout this series, so I like this for her. Bet, yeah, I like it for her too. And she, you know, what I'm saying she grew out of your um list of uh like trash characters, or whatever, woman version. Woman version? I ain't like kidding. well, not woman version, but like uh, you know, not trying to bring her up, but you know, like in that area. My character where, that I don't yeah. care for. Yeah. Yeah, smoker help help me help me kind of get get over a little bit better. What you mean by that? Oh, because he when he was impersonating her, he was on dirt. That's wild. And that's what you want to say. I'm gonna just say smoker helped it out, and I think this fight is helping it out. I'm gonna keep it a buck. I'm gonna keep it a buck. That's wild. That's my woman, man. Yeah, it's a cool episode. I like, um, I felt Zoro was holding back the whole time. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? It was just hard. I was wondering if he was going to slay a woman. Yeah. And I was going to be like, I was going to say if Sanji was here, he probably wouldn't even defend against her, bro. Mm hmm. But Zoro was, uh, he was definitely just holding her off or whatever, but. Just keeping him, keeping, keeping her from hurting him, so. Yeah. That was pretty much it. 
I'm kind of glad she showed up so we, we can uh, go about our day. Probably, probably get a good female fight. Yeah. I feel like we haven't had one in a good minute. Facts. And Can't she really got hockey. When. Yeah. So she's not at a disadvantage. Yep. So Smoker, Smoker doing a good job, man. Hats off to Smoker. That's crazy. But yeah, I'm ready to get to the next episode. See what happens. All right. If you was Zoro, would you slay her? Or would you kind of do the same thing and kind of hold on? She's trying to kill me. I'm going to kill her. They gossiping, bro. <laughs> Why is he leading the G5 to this? Following, play? man. Right. Say he's worried about you. <laughs> mm. Wow, they gave us a flashback of them. Oh, she know firsthand. Mm -hmm. I don't think this was that was the reason though, right? Yo, Tashiki blew up, bro. I ain't even finna cap. Mm. Dang. <laughs> she said height. Hey, right, get off the snow. Well, they get married, G. It's possible. I, I've been shipping them since the beginning. I know a lot of people don't like it, but. Don't drop your guard. We'll see this one. Come on, Tashigi! True form. Hey. She can sense the true form. Oh, the dang! Mm. Dang it! She tried to snake her in this. I used to love snowball fights. Oh! Go crazy! Tashigi! She keep impressing me more and more. Mm. So a lot of years. You think he'll lose his voice as much, much as he be screaming? <laughs> huh? <laughs> he in the same secret room. Oh, this might be something different. <laughs> Man, he's getting played. Excuse me. <laughs> Stranger danger. Hey, she ain't scared. She tripped these bugs. You giving them that COVID vaccine. <laughs> She got some crazy endurance. Boy, she been running for the seven episodes. Hey. Oh, he rubber. So you can seep into those small little places. I was finna be like, bruh, I don't know about that one. This is what I thought was gonna happen when he first was finna climb. Mm hmm. Mm. Hey, she having fun. Can't let your sword get knocked away. Ah! It's like dishonorable to step into a, a swordsman fight, right? Zoro probably wait till the last second. Come on, Tashiki. You let go of her. What's break her neck? Tashiki! He just flicked them on. <laughs> hey, back up. Time's up. Dang it, bruh. Just had to be snow. But he just tried to cut me. 
Snow Woman. She, she backing up. Let's go. I mean, he won't do it though. <laughs> he about to scare it to death and she do like a Usopp thing. Oh, sister. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't even fully swing. It's like he just look at her eyes. What's going on? Could have killed you. He didn't even use hockey. <laughs> oh, you was wondering, huh? Yes, sir. She about to have nightmares. Don't touch her, man. You lose. And your pupil's gone. <laughs> Captain eyeglasses. You can take the credit. <laughs> Did she even use her? I don't think she even used her glasses this whole fight. Mm -mm. I wonder if she noticed. And that's true. Her glasses are broken. Yeah. But she still was able to fight. Oh. I know helping her be able to sense. Logia with a hockey helped mm -hmm. out. Damn. He didn't even care about him next. Like, oh, that sucks. Right. Yeah, I think this is probably uh as weirdly as it seems, this is probably the most impress one of the most impressive things I've ever seen Zoro do. Yep. Like as far as power wise, power scaling wise, like you just don't know what the heck he been doing for two years and what the heck that was. The fact that you cut a Logia like that and it was affecting their powers, like she can't even what tell the her hell body. is that? Yeah, what is that? And then when, when when he slashed her, it was it was a different color, like aura, like it was a, a like a reddish type of aura. Yeah, when. Titty Shiki cut her, it was just a blood cut, but when he cut her, it was a red ore right there. Yeah. That that makes me excited to see what the heck Zoro got now. Dang. Yeah. yeah. I totally 100 percent agree that this is one of Zoro's most impressive feats up like to this far. Mm-hmm. Like pre-time skip and post-time skip. Man. I think I think it's only one other moment I could probably debate it with. I probably my my other moment that I found really impressive. I mean, th this this is like his like his like powers and stuff like yeah. that. Not like the moments of Zoro. Like when he when he just jumped that T bone, he did that like that that blue oh, demon eye. Say, Scott P, uh, yeah, uh, Water Seven. Yeah, area. That was another like show off show off Zoro. Moment. I feel like Zoro be having some nice show off moments. Yeah, yeah. but it's, with this, as far as like the build up, the stuff mm -hmm. that he was saying to her. Yeah. All of that, that, all of that made this moment just crazy. Like even better than like the move, you know, like that movie did underwater when we was at uh, Fishman Island. Mm -hmm. It was supposed to be like a crazy thing after we saw Luffy do Arnhem and stuff. Yeah. This moment right here with the build up and all of that was like three times that, and that was supposed to be like a like a power show. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like I like how they throw major moments in the most unpredictable spots. Yeah. And I feel like this adds to um, Punk Hazard's resume. Yeah. This moment adds to Punk Hazard's resume. The same <laughs> same way the Bull Demon added to to Water 7 and the, the uh, Water 7 in this lobby. I feel like yeah. this adds to Punk Hazard's resume. 
Facts. That man, what did he say? He said, you ever seen an animal, like a crazy savage animal that's not willing to bite or something? Mm -hmm. He's like, because I have it. <laughs> I was like, dang. I'm pretty certain Zoro, at, like, his time he be sitting and sleeping, he just be thinking about stuff to say, like, man, I'm going to say this. Wait till, I, wait till I get somebody with that line. Right. <laughs> with that line, bro. I can't wait. Yeah, Zoro, uh... Hey, that man Cole, I'm glad he on our side, bro. Facts. You know what I'm saying? But this is a dope episode. Like, probably one of my... Hmm. This might be my second... First or second favorite of Punk Hazard so far. Okay. This was wild. Yeah. I, I was, like, on the edge of my seat, bro. Yeah, but I like how they... Like, they did switch a little off, but it wasn't, like, a lot. We probably should have timed it, but I, I, I kind of yeah, this get was good. Whole, I don't want to get into the whole timing it every time, but yeah. But this was good. Like yeah, the fight yeah, was, was like pacing. Yeah, and even when they stopped fighting, they stayed here and had that conversation. You know what I'm saying? But we also said that before, like one piece of one piece of stay there when they want to show some cold stuff. Yeah. But they won't stay for the whole fight. But they stay when it's something cold about to happen. Yeah. So, so that now, I can't, now, now I can't even give them that no more because 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 they did what we thought they was gonna do. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was still fire. It was fire though, it was fire. Like sometimes these build ups like this, even though it take long mm. to get to this point, yeah, it's like the reward, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Sometimes, not all the time, most of the times, you know, One Piece, they do all that and they get to the reward and it's, and it's great. Mm -hmm. Then there are some times where they do all of that and they don't get to nothing. Yeah. And then that's when it's like kind of like a letdown, but but the majority of the time, when you get to these moments like this, it just makes it all worth it, bro. That's true. I 100% I agree. I agree. Yes, sir. But yeah, this is a dope episode, man. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And make sure y'all check the videos out on our Patreon before we put them on YouTube. Facts. Double checking out. Peace. Deuces.